Welcome to today's video. It's about to get really crazy. We're about to surprise Erin with a room makeover and you may remember we did this a while back. However, her room has fallen apart a little bit. It has. Stuff's falling off the walls. It's not as vibey as we made it. It's like eight o'clock in the morning. She just went to school. She has a swim meet today. She comes home. So we're on a very, very tight time crunch to get this entire room made over in the next five hours. Ooh. We're scared. We're very scared right now if we're gonna be able to do this. Well, luckily this time we don't have to paint the wall Or remove wallpaper. So, she has um, no idea this is happening. I have a bunch of cute ideas. We're gonna see how they turn out. I'm a little nervous, but I'm about to show you what the room looks like right now so we can get some before shots. And then we're gonna jump right in because we have got to hurry. Don't forget to subscribe. All right, so we wanna do some curtains here and a collage wall there because the room is a little bit white. We had more decor on the walls that has been taken down. I wanna hang something over here. We're gonna move all this out of here and create a full desk nook for her to be able to study and do the rest of her work there. I'm gonna jazz up the dresser a little bit and clean this up. Furniture from Urban Outfitters. We're gonna keep the rug the same and the furniture the same. However, I think we're gonna remove this and create a record chill corner in her room. Silly! Sue, are you gonna help us or are you gonna hide under our bed all day? All right, he's having under the bed. I love that you never come in here, but that the fact that we're in here. She's in business. Yeah. Okay, first we're gonna get rid of a nightstand. I don't think she uses both, but they're just junk storage. We're moving this shelf to over here. Okay, let me show you guys how Laura measured it. <laughs> I was like, yo. That was okay, like, yeah, it'll fit. We need to clear off all this stuff, so I'm gonna, you know, we're gonna use this stuff and keep it in our room. We're just gonna kind of place it around. Erin also is not that picky with her stuff. I know some people were like, I would hate if someone moved my stuff, but Erin just like doesn't care about stuff like that. There's literally only one thing that Erin's anal about, and that Aaron is Erin would be sent to Mars if she knew I was standing on her bed. That's right now. this right here. Is that what that you're is about to her, say? Yeah, I was like, this is the only thing she cares about. Erin, this footage is for you. Your <laughs> uncle. Erin, tell her stop! Oh, I forgot I did hang up on the wall. <laughs> Well, yeah, we didn't want her to fall. Didn't it fall? <laughs> no, we hung the mirror Something fell on from up here. All right, I'll move this. I think this is from like Target. I'll try to find some of this furniture and stuff and link it. Oh man, I forgot a screwdriver downstairs. No, you have one right here. I'm, pro I'm keeping all this stuff and reusing it. Um, it's gonna go perfectly with what we're doing. Her vibe now is a little more vintage, a little more retro. So I can't wait for you to see this green chair I got for the room. So the wall got a little marked up from the shelf, which I'm covering with collage. This is irritating Ty because he wants to patch them, but we ain't got time for that. Yeah. Also, this doesn't match and it's gonna irritate me, but I didn't have time to find Another pendant light. Low key a hoarder. She keeps everything. 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 I feel like I was kind of like that when I was her age too, though. Bippy, you took yourself out, Bippy. Here is the collage wall. I'm gonna go ahead and add double-sided tape. I'll put on the screen which one this is from Tezza. I'll also link it down below, but this one looked really dark and kind of vintage vibey for Aaron. Okay guys, I'm starting with the collage wall and luckily these are pretty big pictures so they're covering a lot of the wall. Old Mercedes are her favorite. She's always one at one. <laughs> so I put that one in the center of the wall. If you can tell between the two windows. So it would stand out because I figured she'd like that. And then I went with a darker vintage theme. So I'm just picking these out as I go to kind of like see what I think looks good. Oh, I love this green color. So it's gonna be great. So we had a casualty along the way. Mirror shattered as we were trying to move Aaron's desk into the room. I don't know what we're gonna do. You have seven years of bad luck. Well, that's already the case, so. <laughs> I'll split it with you because that we did it together. we broke the mirror. <laughs> uh, collage wall's coming around good though. Is it? Yeah, it's gonna look great. So we're gonna have to either go to Target and get a new mirror. Okay. Or use the mirror from downstairs and replace the one downstairs. Probably gonna steal my mirror from downstairs. And <laughs> yeah. I'm okay with that. All right, here is the retro desk I bought her off Wayfair. It's super cute, has a vintage vibe to it. And uh, we're gonna clean up these black marks on the wall and Ty is working on hanging the shelf. Also an update on the collage wall. It is coming together really well. However, as I expected, this one is so time consuming. So I'm trying to hurry, but I'm absolutely obsessed with the way it's coming out. It's just as I envisioned.
While you guys are enjoying this time lapse, I wanted to take a second out of my video to share some educational content. I partner with Better Internet Initiative. It's a program created by a group of digital creators and professionals who help creators make educational content for their audiences about issues of importance. As I'm sure everyone has felt over the past few months, inflation is on the rise. But there's another factor at play too. Corporations are using the cover of inflation to increase their profit margins by raising prices even more than they have to. Corporations can do this because they have grown so big that they have enough market power to do so without fear of losing business to competitors. And that's where the federal regulations come in. With greater focus on prevention of monopolies, for the first time in a generation, the FTC is working to prevent this. Now let's get back to some wall collage art. I used double-sided tape for this and it worked really well, but I will say this collage did take most of my time for this room, but it was so worth it. You guys have to watch till the end. All right, guys, Ty is finishing these interesting corners where there's crown molding. And uh, this is what the, how cool. Like this looks like a different room already with this. It turned out way cooler than I even envisioned. And I literally just took it all the way down to the baseboard, covered everything and I had to cut a bunch of pieces. So did Ty, we had to measure and cut. He's gonna get that corner. I got all this covered. Wow. I let finish hanging the shelf. I love that it's not Mitch. It doesn't match. That's what kind of gives it the vibe. So I'm going to wipe down the desk just because it's dusty from hanging stuff. And then I'm going to start decorating it because it's time, honey. It's not Windex. I mean, it is Windex. <laughs> it's multi-surface. a vintage store in the valley and I love this table I don't know where I'd put it in a room I don't think I have a spot for it but it's so pretty and I just have like a ton of little vintage boutiques this is a vintage bottle opener I don't even know how it works I feel like I could definitely go to my grandpa's garage and find all of this stuff in there for free but you know he doesn't live in Los Angeles so <laughs> can't really do that how funny what in the world these you can just buy a picture of people. Just random people. <laughs> Ooh, old camera equipment. Oh, that's so cool. We have any Disney adults in the house? I found this section for you. We have a collector who is selling their Disney collection. Huge dice clock. Look at this clock, guys. Dude, this is why I came here. I wanted to find pieces like this. I that is so like, cool. legit made this. Dude. Because, like, look, feel it. Like, it's these are real so dice. heavy. And, and you can, you can see the, the glue. glue is, like, melting out, which is okay. I kind of, like... It works. It's, time it's right. still going. The time is almost right. Oh, my God. Okay, we're getting that. It is $85, but we feel like this will be our most expensive piece. We wanted some real vintage pieces for this room, so we stopped by this antique store. Store. We found some books and other little trinkets that were perfect for the room. We also picked up this vintage radio. It's so cute and perfect for the room. I just forgot to show it on the day that we went shopping. We got some stuff. We got some stuff. Ooh. Okay, wait, what's the name of the store we're at? Oh, there you go. All right, off to the car we go. Okay, this is gonna be a time lapse of me trying to figure out how I wanna decorate this. Wayfair and the candles. That would be cute on the desk. Like a vintage moment. The vintage radio. Here's what I have so far. I'm probably gonna just tweak it a little, but got all this stuff at the thrift store the other day. This is from Urban Outfitters, Urban Outfitters, Urban Outfitters, thrift store, Urban Outfitters, wow. So essentially Urban Outfitters is a big thrift store. Then we got the desk and then candles from Wayfair. I got this notebook in PR. I thought it was just perfect dreamy vibe for the room. And then I just put some of the stuff over here. I may play with it a little bit more, but this is the gist. Ignore that. It is time for the chair reveal. 
Actually, is this even gonna fit? This we'll isn't see. like it's gonna <laughs> No, please fit. My hand measurements, if they were correct. What's your idea? Like that? Well, I was gonna do like catty corner, like like that. Okay. But this it doesn't works. really work, babe. The chair's too big. Chair's gotta go over here. Which ruins my little record idea. Dang it, but what a cool chair is this. If only it was like half the size. The thing is, the chair's a really nice height because it's perfect for the desk. Like the I need the desk to be wider though. It's like my issue. I think it looks good. Let's get the record thing set up and then we'll decide. Plus it's nice because the arms are low. Yeah, okay. We'll finish and decide. Ty's hanging these gold curtain rods I got on Amazon. They look really cool against the wall. Um, we're debating on not hanging a mirror here now that I broke it, but we're gonna see once the curtains are hang it. if it's too busy with the mirror, which it could be. Ty is working on that and it is looking so good. Here are the curtains I got on Amazon. The nice thing about it is they each come with two panels. I'll link them down below. I did it so they would touch the floor, a one at eight measurement. But here's the rod and then like there's two curtains. On. Okay, well that, there we go. <laughs> there's gonna be two so it looks really full and lush I think, but okay. if I need to remove one, I will. Let's see how they look. This room really has always needed a curtain, I think. Boom. All right, I'm gonna get you to just move the steps still and all. Or actually, I need to straighten them out a little bit. Wow, this looks really good. Do they? Yeah, this room is transformed. I know, and I didn't need, we didn't even paint or buy new furniture, isn't that wild? And then I measured and did 108 so they would drag the floor, so it would kind of give that vintage full look. Let's see. They drag the floor. They do. Hey, you my measure measurements that, are right. Did you measure that by hand? Yeah. I just have to steam them now because they're okay. a little wrinkled and I hate that. And then look, we can like clean it up a little bit at the top. I don't know. I'm going to play with them and make sure they're really nice before we move on. All right. So I can't figure out what to do with this wall. So I am taking all the frames around my house. A lot of them are kind of vintage looking, which is perfect. And I'm gonna create like a mini collage wall here and I'm gonna change out the pictures and add in what we have left here to kind of get creative with it, to fill that space, but still make it cohesive with the vintage look of the room. Welcome to the DIY segment of this video. We're in the garage and we just put the lamp together, got it off of Amazon and they have this really expensive lamp from Urban Outfitters I'll put here that I wanted, but it wasn't gonna come in time. I'm gonna try to DIY something similar right now. Ignore those feathers, but I have my hot glue gun, hot glue sticks, and then I bought the tassel off of Amazon. So I'm just gonna place it on here and we're gonna try to make something similar. I'm gonna start with an N. I'll link this tassel down below if you wanna do something similar in the lamp. I got them both off Amazon and I'm just gonna go around the top. Love how fast hot glue dries. Luckily this top swivels, so it like makes this process way easier. And little by little, I'm just gonna go around the top and then cut it. All right, we got one whole round. I just cut the edge off and then sealed it with the glue to make sure it doesn't fray. So next I'm gonna add another layer. This is gonna be a little more difficult with the, maybe like, it's like I don't want it like that, I don't think. I think it looks better. Oh my God, I'm so stupid. I should have started at the bottom and then built my way up. Why didn't I do that? Now I'm gonna have to do with all this right in my way. First time DIYing a lamp also. So there's that. We have to take into account. Maybe I'll put the bottom on like that. I'm finishing up the bottom and I just came upon a genius idea to make this process easier. Whenever your tassel comes in, if you're making this, it's gonna look like this. You actually have to pull this little bottom string right here. That, and they do it so your tassels don't get messed up in shipment. But if you think you ordered the wrong thing, you didn't. I just wanted and, you guys to know. Uh, I was about to say it's actually very satisfying, but then it just got ruined. It is. Oh my God. 
Okay guys, so we're gonna work from the bottom up now. And we're gonna kind of over layer them a bit because it looks kind of sparse and thin whenever you line them up perfectly. But whenever you over layer it, it looks kind of thick and rich like that to make it look really full. And we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five rows of them on this lamp. Once I got my sizing down, this actually does not take any time to do. Like this is such a quick DIY. And with this frayed in, I would just glue it down, put a little extra glue behind it. That way it doesn't keep fraying. Amazing. I have it upside I'm down to get this. some of these shaggies out of the way. She's gonna be like, what is this one? <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get this from? I how different me and you do projects. <laughs> like. I feel like I'm about to get shaded. No, no, no. Like it's the same way you cook too. You don't measure, you just go. I like need it precise. I would have measured and I would have put like a line around I each one. I think we one. both know. I got it done in half the time and with the same outcome. Same outcome, some would say, <laughs> may not be true. <laughs> <laughs> You're so <laughs> up, man. You better keep this in the video. <laughs> I'm gonna measure, measure twice, measure twice, cut once, kind of guy. I'm gonna ask for forgiveness. <laughs> type of girl. If I don't have fun doing it, I don't want to do it and that's not fun to me. Being precise. still moving. Being precise is not fun to you is what you're saying? Yeah, fun. Man, I think you just have like a better eye for like... Oh, that's nice. For doing things like that than I do. I know I'll fuck it up so I, I need a guide. Yeah. The universe. You're better at eyeballing things. Am I? Yeah. We're almost done. Alright guys, this is the finished outcome. It kind of looks like hair. <laughs> I, I think it's gonna look so cute, especially when we put it in a room and light it up tomorrow. It's going to be a little shaggy vibe. I like it. I think you killed it. Thank you. Good job. All right, guys, I'm devastated. We can't figure out what to do with the chair. Watch out. <laughs> Hey guys, Aaron's gonna be home any minute. I think we have like 10 minutes left. I gotta finish off wiping off things and vacuuming. I'm literally panicking, it's crunch time, but we're almost done. only gonna do one pillow on the bed because she does not like a lot of throw pillows so I thought this was kind of an edgy way of doing it with this chartreuse pillow from Urban Outfitters I got. So wiping down all of her countertops because they are a bit dusty. Tyler is flexing the rug where there was a stain that was driving us both crazy. We were like um we're gonna have to get that out and it's looking like it's coming out.
do you think? <laughs> Are you shook? Are you joking? No. Lord, How cool is it? This is so cool! Isn't this so you? Oh my god! Look. This is so crazy. Retro. Like, I actually enjoy my room now. Like, I don't come in here and I'm not like, uh, it's just like a... This is cool. It looked like a mental asylum before. <laughs> like, dead serious. It, it, it was so crazy. But... I feel like this is so And unique. then I have this. He's such an aesthetic too, isn't oh, he? Oh. So what do we think? Is this your vibe? This is my vibe. Yeah, I feel like this is you. Like, this is literally everything about it. I like how it's a bit darker, but it's not too I dark. Knew it. I knew it. I said she's done with boho minimalism. She's more vintage, antique, yeah. retro. Like, this is so cool. How'd you do this? Did you order this? We ordered it, and me and Ty put it together. This is so cool. Yeah. You remember this morning when you were asking me why I had all my tools upstairs? Yeah, I was like, where's the <laughs> I mean, I didn't question it. I said, cool I'm just going to work on stuff. I know, like, I want to sit in it and um, pull it out. Should I actually do schoolwork now? <laughs> yeah, this is now that you're at the end of your senior year. Now that I only have, like, maybe, like, what? The chair's a little big for the space, but it's no, so No, but cool. it's so good. Isn't it? Oh, my God. This is All your so stuff is still in here. Just... No, no, I love it. These are the extras in case. I love it. Look, we went to a vintage antique store and got all this stuff. Even this is a real stereo from the 70s. It's That's cool. insane. Isn't that cool? Me and Ty DIY'd this lamp. No, you didn't. Yeah, we did. Did you really? Yeah, it looks pretty good, huh? No, it looks so good. I thought you would buy this from freaking Urban Outfitters. Hey! This is, hey, bro, this is <laughs> Urban Outfitters. Yes. Oh, my God. And then we removed a nightstand. How do you feel about that? I'm fine. One she couldn't thing. open one of them up anyways. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it was that one. Well, yeah, we'll <laughs> the one we left. We'll trade them out. We'll trade them out, but like, yeah, no, I love this. It looks so sharp I even love here. this, the, the all the way up here and everything. Right? Looks cool. It looks so good. All right, well, well there we go. okay, well, we're gonna enjoy the room off camera now, but thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go cry for Aaron's like 30 minutes. <laughs> Just like, oh my goodness, this I is even my vacuumed room. and dust every little. I hope you guys grinning. know, like, I'm not leaving my room now. It's such a vibey, cool room. It is. It's also more mature too. Yeah. The other one. It, I just want to change this now. Yeah, we gotta get a new pendant. I want something like gold and metal to match your hardware here. And yeah. There, or like brassy. Yeah. That would look good, but yeah, this is insane. This Sharp. is crazy. Honestly, you know what I thought I was gonna walk into? What? For some reason I thought it was just gonna be like a giant, like something really stupid, like stuffed animal on my bed. Why? For some reason. Why would we get you that? That was like my first thought. I was like, maybe from like- Dude, we a, did this so fast too when you left this morning. We were like- We've been working ever since you left. <laughs> did you really? Yeah, you that's why I was really? getting stuff prepared so we could just get going. I know, you are probably like, she gonna leave? Yeah, <laughs> literally. Yeah, like, oh, get out of the house. Cool. Like, no, yeah. I never would expect any of this. This is insane. Subscribe before you leave. I hope you guys love the video. Subscribe, and there will be another video where of Aaron redoing our room. Yes. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, let's see how that goes. <laughs> no. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.